everyone in our today's tutorial we will see how to auto generate participation certificate for any quiz with the help of google form google form we are already using uh, for conducting exams and we are already using auto grading google form so there the uh, you know responses are automatically graded only we have to use it's a very simple procedure we have to use a add on certify m so that whenever any participant will uh, complete submitting a google form he or she <coughs> will be receiving a certificate that will be auto generated certificate participation certificate so please watch the video thank you very much hello everyone in our today's tutorial we'll see how to auto generate downloadable participation certificate for any quiz using Google form. So if we conduct any quiz for our students or for the teachers for any participant after completion of the quiz when the participant will submit it a auto generated participation certificate will be sent to the email of the participant. So it's a very simple method using a very simple method and using just normal Google form we can do it. So we'll see the step by step procedure for creating da uh, downloadable participation certificate. So let's see what we need to do. First we need to uh, open our Gmail account. Then we have to go to drive and from the drive we have to go to Google Doc in google docs we have to create a new document which will be a google form so we have to create a new google form so here we have opened a new google form here as you can see you have to give the exam title or the quiz title that you are creating we have already created quiz we have conducted exam through google form quiz so we know how to do it but still you have to give the title for the quiz first and then uh, you have to open your gmail go to drive and from doc create and new google form go to settings in the form and make it self grading so you have to make the quiz self grading how to do that as you can see you will be clicking on the sign of setting you have to click on setting and then then these three uh, menus will be shown one is general one is presentation one is quizzes you will go to quizzes and you will just see you will flip this part you have to enable this make this quiz make this a quiz and whenever you will make uh, will be making it a quiz then it will be a self grading will be enabled there so you have to do you do not have to grade it it will be auto graded and after that see in the top right corner three dots are being shown here okay so you have to click on that three dot then this drop down menu will be coming and you have to click on add-ons see it's already marked there you have to click on add-on when you will be click on add-on you will be shown all the possible add-ons that are there for uh, this G Suite marketplace. There are many add-ons like many of us we have already used form limiter or any other add-on here. So from this add-ons we have to select certify M as it's being pointed out here. Certify M for self-certification you have to select this certify M. It's a very simple procedure. So we'll go there and when we'll click on certify M, it will ask us to install it. So we have to install this add-on. So when you will click on install, first you have to choose an account for which you want to enable this add-on. So I'm choosing uh, one of my Gmail account here. So you have to choose that particular account, login. And then in the next step, you have to give certain access to certify M. So uh, it will ask for a few access. So you have to give that. And after that, you have to click on allow. When you will click on allow, certify M will be installed in your particular Gmail account. 
then again we will have to go to the google form that we were creating first now see a new symbol add on symbol has been is being shown here that means we have already selected we have already got this particular add, add on enabled in our system we have to click on the add on and it will show certify m because this is the only one add on that we have installed we have to click on certify m then what will happen yes uh, when we will click on certify m it will show this pop up menu so in this pop up menu what are the, me the menus are being shown here the menus are being shown here are so uh, show certify m controls and some others are also there recent certificate that uh, is uh, we are basically not using because we have we are yet to send any certificate so we have to select show certify m controls from there and whenever we will select it in that you no know, bottom right corner of our google form this dialog box will open see first menu is status certification is by default it will be switched off you have to turn it on and when you will turn it on just beside this turn on off uh, menu there is something called link to the exam you have to click on that and you have to link to a particular google form this particular google form then see passing is 80 percent that means we are setting the passing criteria that if the participant is uh, scoring 80 percent and above then he or she will get the certificate so you can give you can set the passing criteria like this or you can just select participation that means whoever will participate will get a certificate so you can set it from here now see template template uh, uh, some preview all you have to click on preview all to see all the possible templates there so if we click on preview all it will show you all these templates so you have to choose one among uh, from there like i have chosen that yellow one the third one that's being shown i have chosen that okay so after clicking on preview the format choose the format from the available formats like you are done with the certification part now you will go back to your previous google form that you are creating like we have created the name we have given taste to though the full name is not uh, showing here one extra question will be creating other than the normal quiz questions that you are creating normal quiz questions will be self graded but here one extra question like we have created enter your full name because for certification full name will be required so we are giving enter your full name and it will be a short answer question but make sure these drop down menus are there text like we have chosen you have to choose text from here because by default maybe it's number so number uh, we will not be choosing definitely uh, for name will not be accepting numbers so you have to take text uh, text from there so we are done with that now we will just have to send it so we are clicking on send whenever we click on send this window will appear uh, so here as you can see uh, email we have to give the email id of the participants where uh, we need to we want to send this particular google form or quiz if we want to send by whatsapp we'll click on the link like it's being shown by this red line is for link and the maroon line is for uh, email click on send and it will be sent to the email id of this particular participant so if you want to send it to all the students of your class you will copy all of their you know email id and you will paste it at a time so at a time you can paste all the email ids of the students next is whenever you will click on send like i have given my own id only as recipient's email id like this an email will be received in the email, recipient's email id 
mail box like uh, fill out the google form i have invited you to fill out this particular google form when the recipient will click on this a google form will open he or she will fill up the google form and just after that if the participant is scoring 80% or more than that then another mail will be automatically sent here you do not have to do anything automatically another mail will be sent to the mailbox of the participant that is congrats so and so you passed your certificate is attached to this email you have to download it so as you can see the certificate is received now if i download this is a downloadable certificate it will be shown like this uh, i have scored 100% whatever will be the score of the student that will be shown here so like this it's a very simple procedure like this you can generate uh, auto generate certificate for uh, the participants of any uh, particular uh, quiz using google form so i hope this tutorial will be helpful to you thank you very much for uh, watching this and please try it it's a very easy procedure and a very uh, useful procedure thank you